Darkling, darkness is your ally. You merely adopted the dark. I was born in it, molded by it. I didn't see the light until I was already a man. By then it was nothing to me but blind. The shadows betray you because they belong to me. News, religion, hip hop, and politics. I'm banned in America. I'm the shadow band man. Make sure you leave your thoughts in the comment section. So, I just get on YouTube, right? And one of the things that I'm noticing, and I don't know why, but one of the things that I'm noticing is this fake yoga taking over the world. You know what I'm saying? Like, this, this fake girl yoga is really just invading the world right now. You know what I'm saying? Now, if you don't know what fake yoga is, let me break it down so it's forever broke. Fake girl yoga is a female on some type of social media platform in the tightest clothes on the earth or hardly any clothes on the earth. And then she's doing these stretches. Now, if you know anything about yoga, then you know it's a spiritual journey. It's a mental journey. However, when you see these females on these, I only saw two. You know what I'm saying? I saw I saw two. It was like a short, and then it led me to another long video. And I'm like, yo, why is this popping up on my timeline? I ain't never, I never um looked at no yoga video on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was really, I was more than a little angry. And see, since you don't know me, you don't know how I get angry. I'm a, I'm angry most of the times. So you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just super angry. I'm an angry type of person. You know what I'm saying? Especially if I ain't take medication to manage the anger. <laughs> but um, <laughs> it's crazy. It's TMI, huh? TMI. Okay, yeah. But um, yeah, so this back to this fake yoga. So it, it was like a, a 40 second short. First, I wasn't even looking at the, the screen or whatever, right? Because you know, you be on your phone, you just over there getting ready to start some videos or whatever. You know what I mean? You just chilling. You know what I'm saying? You just trying to get your mind right. Yo, look up like, yo, why is this girl bending on like this, doing all these sex positions? You got what I'm saying? Because that's what they need to call it. They call it yoga, but they need to just call it sex position stretching because that's what it seemed like. And then, you know, you scroll through the comments. Ain't nobody talking about yoga in the comments, though. You understand what I'm saying? That's the last thing they talk about in them comments is some yoga. You got what I'm saying? But I just don't understand why everything is just, it seems as if we are coming to a point in time where nobody respects anything. People can't take, it's like people can't take nothing serious. That's what, that's what it seemed like to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, it would seem like you would think, Yoga is something serious, you know, you know, you're like, you know what? Hmm. I ain't going to play with that right there. But nah, man, everybody playing with everything nowadays. You know what I'm saying? It's, just, it's ridiculous, man. It's like you can't, nobody can take anything serious because nobody is serious anymore. So to me, yoga is something that's serious. It's something that you're supposed to really focus on. You know, you're focusing on breathing. You're focusing on being in tune with whatever you're trying to be in tune with. You got what I'm saying? Some people say, hey, it gives me the opportunity to be one with the universe. It gives me an opportunity to reflect. It gives me an opportunity to, to focus and channel my energy, et cetera, right? Not nowadays, man. If you in the 2020s, Somebody say they got a yoga video, it ain't, it's a no-go video. You know what I'm saying? That ain't yoga, that's no-go. You know what I'm saying? But I just, I really have a problem with all of these videos that be clickbaiting and just lying and acting like they something that they not. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
Man, I I don't know, man. I just I just got on to just just talk about that. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm really tired of these fake yoga pages. That's not yoga. What you doing? You that ain't yoga. What you doing, girl? That ain't yoga. No, that ain't. That's noga. That's what we calling that from now on. Like yo, <laughs> yeah. But yo, like I said, they they it was a short. It, I looked up. It was a short. It was like maybe I think like 47 seconds. I'm like, man, what's this? So boom, finished texting who I was texting. Like, yo, this is people crazy. Yo, holla at you. Da 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 da. Boom, it went over into a long video, different person, but a long video of this fake noga. You know what I'm saying? Of this 100% noga, fake yoga. You understand what I'm saying? So then, I'm looking at this female, right? Now, I'm not gonna act like she ain't look good and her body ain't look good, but when I'm looking at her, I'm like, yeah, that's on. I'm not thinking about yoga when I'm looking at her. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm not looking. I'm not thinking about yoga at all when I'm looking at you. And I don't think you want me to think about yoga when I'm looking at you doing this noga. You know what I'm saying? Like it's ridiculous, man. Like I don't know. It's like a thirst trap. You know what I'm saying? It's just, just ridiculous, you know what I'm saying? So then 17 hours later, I'm getting on complaining about it. Nah, I'm just playing. Nah, but seriously, you know, I'm I know I'm making light of things, but yo, it really gets on my nerves, man. You know what I'm saying? It's like you can't, you can't trust nothing. You can't even trust people to be who they say they are. You say you're doing yoga, you ain't doing yoga. Say what it is. And then I gotta go to your OnlyFans and this, that, and the third. It's like, yo, man, just say what it is. B, I keep telling people, and I'm going to tell you like this. You got to do what you say you're going to do, and you got to be who you say you're going to be. And the problem is, too many people can't be who they say they are. Why you can't just be who you say you are? If you official, be official. If you know how to handle it, you know how to carry it and carry it that way. I'm telling you, man, we just so just influenced by a fake, fraudulent, artificial world. And you so happy with all this fakeness that you just be like, okay, that's okay. Nah, it ain't okay. People got to be who they say they are. And you got to hold people accountable for what they do or what they fail to do. And if you don't do that, you destroy the whole world. The whole world is built on order. That's why I be so angry sometimes with the culture of hip hop. I get angry with the culture of hip hop because a lot of times what we do is we steal these sons. We pull their soul out and send them to death. That's what you do. You pulling their soul out by leading them down the wrong road through the music and never giving them an alternative. You, you sending them down the wrong road to death by giving them that fake religion. You trying to give them your religion and you ain't even living it. Don't nobody respect you because you ain't even living what you say you living. How you even respectable? You can't even be what you say you gonna be. So if you can't be what you say you gonna be, you know you ain't gonna do what you say you gonna do. So now you want people to believe in some this mystery, magical force in the sky that don't do nothing but make you rich. I seen this dude the other day. He was a wannabe pastor preacher, right? Talking about, hey, brother, give me this and do this and the Lord this and the da, 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 saying all this crazy stuff. And I'm looking at this dude like, what is he talking about, yo? And these other people looking at this dude like, yo, what are you talking about, yo? Can't nobody relate to none of that craziness? Speak to people in a way that they can relate. People from the streets, they ain't from this seminary school and they ain't go to, 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 to some type of college to, so that they can speak to people in a way that make them emotional and make them give you their money. 
Yo, you got to, we just coming, we just living in a bad time. We living in a terrible time where people keep acting like they something that they not. Everybody want to fake. What happened to the real? Everybody want to look like they make it. Everybody, nobody want to get it out the mud. Man, shout out to Kevin Gates. You got to get it out the mud sometime. Where the people who got it out the mud? Everybody got it popping. I remember being a child and we used to live, we lived homeless. We lived in a home that did not belong to us and it didn't even have no windows. And my father had to put like plastic over the windows and I could just give you kind of craziness. He wasn't acting like he was bigger than what he was and acting like he was something that he wasn't. He had to grind and get in the situation that he could provide. Yo, I don't, I don't understand, yo. Just work for what you got. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you got to hustle what you got to hustle. I ain't, I ain't knocking that. Yeah, your hustle is your hustle, whatever your hustle is. But, yo, everybody want to look like they something that they not. Everybody want to talk like they something that they not. It just, it just really gets on my nerves. Everybody doing it, too. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, man, and especially with, like, this YouTube stuff, everybody want to act like they this and act. Yo, you ain't, man. Man, we know your texture, man. You ain't even cut like that. You ain't even built like that. Why you acting like you built like that when you know you not? You ain't even built like that, yo. I, I don't, I'm not understanding the mentality, yo. I just don't get it. You know what I'm saying? I just don't get it, man. I, I just, like I said, man. This yoga girl made me think of all these thoughts that I'm thinking when I'm thinking when I'm talking to you. You know what I'm saying? But, man, I just wish we could come into a time where you could meet someone and they official. You meet them and they who they say they are. Because trust me, when people meet me and when I meet a couple of people, trust me, I see that they be official. They know how to keep it. Send a massing up. They already know what it is. So why you can't just be you? Be who you are. Do what you say you're going to do and be what you say you are. <sighs> Stay fearless. Be a warrior. Shadow band.